All right, guys, my yellow shit is finally here. This is the unboxing of um, stuff that I ordered from Smart Maker, the Smart Duino, and Kickstarter. Um, I got the basic kit, I do believe, but then after the fact, uh, I backed for quite a bit more. I spent over a hundred bucks on stuff, and it's been over a year. Um, lots of broken promises. Lots of people accusing Dimitri Albino of being a scammer, and rightfully so. I was one of those people because it seemed like every bit of information he would give us um, that trickled down in the end to to rarely giving us any information just seemed to be wrong. Um, so anyway, we actually have a product here, which means the company actually did exist, and the product actually did exist. Um, question is, I mean... How stupid do you have to be to run a company that can't get a product out the door in under a year? I mean, I'm not saying that... It, it, I mean, I know it's hard work because I've seen it done. Um, I actually backed the Tiny Duino project on Kickstarter. That's ran by Ken Burns over in Akron, Ohio. And um, his system is just as complex and it's small, tiny, and little connectable bus between the the Arduino boards and everything and he was more than able to crank it out and he started with no warehouse um, and no equipment and was able to get that all done and ship his product fairly quickly um, so anyway I'm gonna open this up now sorry for the shaky camera I usually use a tripod and an actual camera instead of my cell phone um, but I figured I would get this out as quick as I can so I'll probably do a separate review if these things last without me crumpling them to pieces because I'm so ticked off it took so long to get this stuff. Um, so yeah, I'm going to actually pause the video, I'm going to open this up, and then we'll resume from there. Alright, here we go. Um, I noticed my order, not everything is shipped. Of course, the free SOC adapter and the tiny Duino adapter, which apparently was cancelled. <laughs> because of communication issues between Ken trying to, to communicate with Dimitri. Um, this make block thing right here makes me sick because this is one of the projects, if I'm not mistaken, that Dimitri decided to work on while our product was just apparently sitting there rotting. Um, anyway. Let's see what we got here. I, I noticed on my shipment my electric imp was not supposed to come in this. And it looks like on back orders the free SOC. Oh, it looks like the electric imp is probably not on back order, but the smart host imp module probably is. So that's why I didn't get that. I was wondering why. Um, wow. Yeah. Okay. On back order. That'll be another year. Oh, look at there. Cat 6E cable. How nice of them. They should have included like a 100 foot cable. You know, it might have made up for the mistakes. All right, I'm going to dump this box out. Oh, the Do It Yellow t-shirt, which I might wipe my ass with, and then it'll be Do It Yellow Brown. As you can tell, I'm a little ticked off at this project. I I've backed several projects, probably over 20 now, um, on Kickstarter. Never had any problems to this magnitude. Alright, I'm trying to find something nice to say here. Here's our power adapter for the bit. Um, this looks like power adapter down to tinier power adapter. Alright. Ooh, the special, really special USB cable. Hopefully I still get my electric amp after this video, because, you know, hey, there is the electric amp. So when they uh, highlighted on my uh, back order thing here, it's just a smart host that was on back order. The, the interface for this, between this and the Smartduino. So I'm excited to actually get that. Um, 
I actually emailed the people over at Electric Imp and asked them um, to intervene and contact Dimitri or Smart Maker because my order had been placed over a year ago and the updates we were getting didn't seem to make any sense. And that guy was actually really nice. I'll have to uh, get his information. He was he was awesome. He, he contacted them and got an immediate response, which is kind of crazy considering I had been contacting them for weeks and not getting a response. They did initially, SmartMaker did, um, but then they just quit responding altogether. Um, okay, well, I'll have to double check my order, but I believe all of it's here. I'm not even gonna hook it up at the moment because I think it deserves its own review. Yeah, I think it's all here. It looks like it. Ethernet module. All right, well anyway, for you guys on Kickstarter, <clears throat> The shit does exist, and it is real. The company, Smart Maker, apparently is one of the worst ran companies, and Dimitri is not a very good manager. Um, he probably could have saved a lot of hassle if he would have hired somebody to help him manage the company, and it would have been more successful. Sadly, right now, um, I'm a huge microcontroller buff. All, all this stuff here sounded cool a year ago. But other products have came out since then, so I'm not sure where I'm even going to use this now, even in prototyping, or if I even want to. The whole system now kind of just makes me sick. I mean, what happens when uh, I'm writing code for one of these things and either it doesn't work, or you know, I need to get in contact with Smart Maker, um, and <laughs> yeah, I doubt they'll even respond. So the community is going to have to rally around each other to probably help each other out with issues. But anyway, I'm going to get this video uploaded. Um, it looks like everything's here. I'll put in the description if, if something else is, is missing that I was supposed to have gotten. I'm really surprised that Electric Imp came because it wasn't shown on the shipping info on SmartMaker.com. But apparently it's just because of that um, the Smart Host adapter for the Imp there. All right. Hopefully this helps some of you out that are a little frustrated. You are going to get your product, but I don't know if you're going to feel like even using it um, once you get it because you've waited this long.